About six weeks ago, I interviewed an expert in making money online every single month. Well, you can imagine we got a lot of questions on that video, including if she was a real person because we used an avatar, how taxes work, is there ageism, how does PayPal charge you, and a whole bunch of other things. Today she's back, and we're going to give you all your answers in today's video. Happy Sunday, everybody. It's Robin with Creativity RV. I hope you're all doing well out there. We are lucky today because my friend TJ is back. We had hundreds and hundreds of comments, a lot of them asking, first of all, why she was using an avatar, like you can see here. That's her. She's real. She's live. And we're going to explain that today along with answering all of your other questions. If you didn't see the last video... The reason we did it is that I'm the author of the book, Work From Home While You Roam, The Ultimate Guide to Jobs That Can Be Done From Anywhere. And TJ actually wrote me an email to say thank you because she had made so much money out of the book and we became friends. But if you look at the book, like she was saying, there are over 300 jobs. What we highlighted in the video we're talking about are three companies that do market research and user testing. So like if... A company is coming out with a new app. They'll have people test it first. Or market research companies will look at people with different demographics. And that's what she's doing. And I'll link that video down below so you can see those three companies and watch that and get her advice for how to succeed with those companies. I don't want to speak for you, but you've made two to $3,000 a month for how long doing this? For since um, at least 2020. I started in 2020. I honestly thought in order to make money online that I had to go sit my butt down between, you know, 8 a.m. and 4 p.m. or a night shift and doing customer service, that sort of thing. I had no idea this world existed, and I bought your book when I saw it, and that led me to this. That led me to making all of this money, and I did some other research as well, and um, you started it all for me, and I really appreciate that. So that's really why I'm doing this interview is my way of saying thanks back to you for doing it. Thank you. And uh, yeah, by the way, we're going to get into the questions now, but I got a lot of comments from people that have already gotten the book and they were not able to update the book. So that doesn't apply to everybody, but I'm going to tackle that at the end and also show you some of the scammers that have tried to knock off the book. So if you do go over and look at it, you don't get one of the awful ones um, <laughs> that are not me. But um, I have a way for you to update the book automatically. So... If that's you, please watch until the end. So, TJ, you want to get into some of the questions? Let's go. I'm going to go ahead and start with the avatar questions. Um, a lot of them we erased because they were just rude. She um, doesn't have any responsibility to show people her face. She's just here to help. So the first question says, given the mistrust about the avatar... It might have been better to have presented this as a phone interview. I admit that I had mixed feelings at the start of the video, but the information TJ shared sounds credible. This is work requiring time and effort and definitely not a get rich quick scheme or easy money. It's basically, it basically boils down to putting the effort consistently and doggedly. Good luck to all those that seek and may find. Okay. Um, other people said they didn't find the avatar distracting at all and Somebody said, obviously, she approaches the job professionally in an organized, consistent manner. I enjoy the presentation. If you're in the workplace, avatars are common in Zoom and Teams meeting. This is not 1990. <laughs> and then somebody said, she is smart, staying anonymous. Taught me something right away. Look, she's a real person. That is not an avatar. I'm not an avatar. Oh, I'm just hiding my heel in uh, like I want to get some breakfast. How about you? You want to get some more yum, 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 right? Right? But I'm feeling like a bun bun. Oh my god. I'm feeling like I want to be like in a Halloween special. I want to be in a Halloween special too. Hello! Dinosaur. Rawr, rawr. Are you a dog person or a cat person? Because I'm i like a dog person. You guys, this is what avatars do. Avatars are all over these kinds of calls. You can Google this for yourself. TJ is a real person. We're going to go over to another screen where we can show you screenshots and answer your questions. Ready, girl? Ready. Let's do it. So, uh, I first I want to start off, why did I use an avatar? It allows me to protect my privacy. 
uh, so I can share this valuable information to you, but also keep my privacy online. I'm a private person. I don't, uh, I don't do Twitter. I don't do Instagram. But also professionally, for to do this kind of work, I really don't want my face out there. I want it to be uh, more anonymous. It's about comfort and uh, being anonymous. Gotcha. And you guys, look, she's not getting anything for doing this video with us. She's literally doing it out of the kindness of her heart to help people. And I've been on YouTube now for five years, and I like to keep it pretty drama-free. But I've learned over time there are going to be negative people. Let's call them haters. Let's call them trolls in the comments. And I look at them most of the time like a pothole. When you're going down the road, uh, they're just a nuisance. But for everybody else that's actually trying to get real information from a real person that wants to help you make money on...